Namaste and welcome to Breathwork and Astrology. Today we're going to be looking a little bit at our karma and our dharma, south node and north node. North node is in Gemini with Mercury coming up, or already past it actually, and then we have, um, or coming up to it, and then Venus is also coming up to the north node. Then we have our south node, all our karma and all our debris and all the things that we've been doing in Sagittarius. Maybe we've been focusing on the way things we've been taught. Maybe this is just our lineages that have shown us this is the only way. And we're coming into this new era of breaking free. So let us get started. Hands on the chest, one hand on top of the other, eyes gently closed, lips together, but teeth lightly parting. So a little smile on the lips. With the eyes closed, turn the eyes up to the point of the third eye between the eyebrows. Let your breath begin to move. Just gently gliding in and gliding out and notice the sensation of breath and breathing. This is ease and flow. Again, eyes slightly closed and the gaze up towards the point of the third eye. Let the breath move in and out. We're just going to acquaint ourselves with the breath, how we are breathing right now in this moment, how we've been programmed to breathe, if you will. Never really been taught to breathe. This is the old paradigm that is going away. Next time you breathe out, empty yourself a breath. Stay empty of breath, squeeze it all out, every last, single, tiny, tiniest drop. Begin a new fresh inhale through the nose. And then glide the breath out and just soften it out through your nose. At the bottom of the breath, squeeze it out. Find the root lock, pelvic floor, up into the body. And inhale. Enjoying the sensation of the breath as it fills you, delights you, empowers you, inspires you. And then when you exhale, hold the breath out from the top to the bottom. And yeah, taking your time as you're inhaling. And then as you're exhaling, all the breath out, all the way to the bottom, squeezing, wringing everything out. You can do that one more time, inhaling. Belly is expanding, diaphragm is expanding, chest is expanding, back, kidneys, even the back of the head, top of the head, front of the face. And exhaling every drop softly and slowly out, emptying body completely, coming into still space. Linger in the stillness of the space. Inhale, slowly bring your hands together in front of your heart. Atma Anjali. Now let's take a moment here to find in our heart, a place in our heart that we feel great reverence. That we can look at the path that we've walked and feel that we have walked the right path. That everything that we've walked and experienced to date in life has brought us to this pinnacle point in time to re-evaluate, to discern what we wish to bring forward with us. And this is a time of great discernment, is understanding our dharma. So we're moving through a place of actually reviewing everything that we've been taught, bringing in new knowledge. So within your heart, what do you give great reverence to? Who are you? How do you wish to be instill yourself in the world. This is your time, remember that. Bow chin to chest and offer that reverence, just a gratitude of your brilliance. Saying that I've even just walked a great path, no matter how mottled it has been, maybe bruised or damaged or punished, seemingly, sometimes even feeling annihilated. But we're coming back to this place of reclaiming our truth. All of us here. 
Put your thumbs to the place of your third eye. On that space of inner guidance, always guiding you. Giving the way to be in life, always. Hands back down to the heart. Take a deep breath in. Let's jump over the mouth, sigh the breath out. We're gonna take our hands, like onto our lower rib cage here. As you breathe in, feel your navel where your fingers are resting on your tummy, and just breathing into that like a big belly. But then where your hands are resting on your lower rib cage, feel that starting to open up. And the top of the breath, gently hold. And then we're gonna exhale the breath out. So we're just warming up the diaphragm. It's like we're going for a jog before we start to sprint on the track. So we're gonna inhale. Nice, soft, slow, deep breath. Feel the diaphragm. And then here, sigh the breath out. And the sighing is this indication of letting things go. No things needed anymore. Just allowing yourself to relinquish old thoughts, old thinking, old patterns, the way things were. This is letting go of our karmas, inhaling deeply. Back of the throat nice and open. And then breathe the breath all the way out. So we're gonna do that again, we inhale deeply, hold the breath. Hold the breath just a little longer. And then we're gonna sigh the breath out all the way from the top to the bottom. We're gonna do that again. Inhale deeply. Feel the diaphragm starting to stretch wide open. Not just the front of the chest, also feel the back side of your chest. Suspend the breath there in the center. Feel the breath that's like encapsulating all that you are. And now letting go, just everything that we've ever learned. We're coming back to wisdom. We're coming back to this place of purity by emptying ourselves completely. Let's take one more deep breath in. And then exhale the breath out. Let us stay empty of breath just for a moment, just squeezing everything out. Navel into lower spine. Feel the pelvic floor lightly draw up into the body so you feel yourself like taking a paper bag and just scrunching it all the way down. Slide your hands to your knees, palms down on your legs. Eyes are lightly closed. The gaze is to the point of the third eye. We're going to do Bastrika. We're going to do Bastrika breath. Bastrika is bellows breath. It's a nice diaphragmatic breath. It's going to be a full inhale and a complete exhale. We're going to start this all together. To find your breath in your body first and press out all your breath all the way to the bottom. Let it all out. Now as we inhale deeply, big diaphragmatic breath. And now press the breath out. Again. And exhale. If you look down to your navel, you see your navel expanding, and then when you press the breath out, out. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Exhale all the breath out. Stay empty your breath. Squeeze every drop of breath. Inhale slowly. Exhale, sigh the breath out. We'll do that again. We inhale slowly. We 
exhale, soften the breath out. All the way out. As we're going to inhale to a count of four, three, two, one. We're going to hold the breath for a count of four, three, two, one. Now we're going to exhale for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're going to inhale four, three, two, one. Hold the breath. Four, three, two, one. Exhaling. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. Inhale. Four, three, two, one. Hold. Four, three, two, one. Exhale. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale. Four, three, two, one. Hold. Four, three, two, one. Exhale. Four, sorry, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, four, three, two, one. Hold, four, three, two, one. Exhale, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, four, three, two, one. Hold, four, three, two, one. One, exhaling, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Squeeze all the breath out. Find Mula Bandha. Root lock, lightly squeeze up into the body. Inhale slowly through the nose. Exhale, sigh the breath out. Can you do that again? Inhale deeply. Exhale, sigh the breath out. We're going to do another round of that. So inhaling four, three, two, one. Hold four, three, two, one. Exhale eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale four, three, two, one. Hold four, three. Two, one, exhaling, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, four, three, two, one. Hold, four, three, two, one. Exhaling, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One more round. Inhale, four, two, one. Hold, four, one, exhaling, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, all the breath out, inhale, exhale, sigh the breath out, one more time, inhaling, exhale, sigh the breath out, we're going to do one more round this time. We're going to count to five, five, and ten. So inhaling, five, four, three, two, one. Hold, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, five, four, three, two, one. Hold, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, five, four, three, two, one. Hold, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one, all the way out. Squeeze or oh, tighten or bring awareness to your root lock. Squeeze the breath out. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, sigh the breath out.
and deep breath in. Exhale the breath out. We're going to do another round of Bella's breath, by streaker breath or diaphragmatic breathing. So we start together, you're going to inhale through the nose. You're going to exhale through the nose. It's a sharp inhale through the nose. Betty goes out. Sharp exhale through the nose. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, sigh. And do another deep breath in here. Exhale, sigh, breath out. Take your left thumb, just stick it out. You're gonna wrap your right fingers around your left thumb. It's almost like you make a fist around it. And then your fingers on your, on your left hand you can bring to the tip of that right thumb and you can rest it down or you can hold it in front of your chest, whatever feels more comfortable. We're gonna start with a round of deep Ujjayi breaths. So we're gonna inhale through the nose. First, just exhale out through the mouth. We're gonna inhale through the nose. We're gonna exhale through the nose. Bring your awareness to the back of your throat. So as you inhale, there's a sound, a pranava. Hear that, it's like the ocean wave. And then exhaling, even hear that sound on the exhale. Keep breathing. It's a long, slow, deep breath. Find your spine nice and tall, crown of the head reaches towards the sky. Lips lightly soft, gently touching, back teeth on. And we're sitting nice and tall. The south node represents all our old patterns, all the things we've been taught, everything that has come before us. Our lineages, society imprinted upon us, ingrained upon us. We've been taught this is the way to be, that the box is the only way to live. And the North Node is inviting you to a new future, a new potential. It's allowing you to step into your Dharma, your potential, what is rightfully yours. So take a moment to think what is rightfully yours. Maybe something's been imprinted upon you. You've been taught that this is the only way to do life. But there's a drive inside of you that tells you, feels, is coming more alive. A drive that's saying that this is not the only way, that there's something more. So from a collective perspective, we are all going through this. We're finding new ways of being in this world. How are you being in this world? What are you choosing to relinquish? Right, Pluto in retrograde, asking us to review everything that we've been through. Everything, at least for the last 100, 200 years. And then by 2022, there's going to be a greater review, especially well, in the United States, a Pluto return. Also, we have, from a Western perspective, we have Jupiter in Pisces just at that zero degrees, so there's something new 
a new way of expanding Jupiter feels at home in Pisces. It's going to retrograde back into Aquarius and then come back into Pisces. So we're going to review some things that we have done. Mercury is going into retrogrades very soon. We can feel the effects of Mercury too. And with Gemini, North Node, this is all mercurial energy that we are feeling. Our minds are being asked to discern. Are you discerning? So breathe into your body. Let it all go by sighing the breath out. Let's inhale for a count of five, four, three, two, one. You're going to hold this time for a ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And as we exhale, just exhale slowly. You can even exhale through the lips. Just let the breath come out. We're going to inhale for that count of five, four, three, two, one. Suspend the breath for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And then sigh the breath out. Just If it's nose or mouth, whichever way it feels right for you, inhale through the nose. Five, four, three, two, one. Suspend for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Breathe the breath out. A couple more rounds. Inhale for five. Suspend for ten. And exhale slowly, breath out. Again, inhaling five. Suspend the breath for ten. Exhaling breath out through the lips and the nose. Again. Suspend. Exhale the breath out. Two more rounds, inhaling. Exhaling. Oh, hold the breath. Now exhale the breath out. One more round. Inhaling. Suspend the breath. Ten. Exhale the breath out. Release your hands, palms up on your thighs. Gaze to the point of the third eye. Lightly turn your eyes up. Tip of the tongue behind the two front teeth. Long, slow, deep breathing with that sound of ujjayi. Light constriction through the back of the throat or awareness. The back of the throat is wide open. Listening to the sound of the breath. Sagittarius in the South Node, it's patterns we're willing to release. To live more of an emotionally rich life. It's letting go of restlessness. It's letting go of preachiness. Claustrophobia. <laughs> Impatience. Unrealistic mm -hmm. ideas. About life fulfillment. It's about coming back to a little bit more of a practical point of view, not being so future orientated or even sometimes overly generous. This is about being a seer and a visionary, holding a greater truth, seeing the goal for what it is. It's 
and seeing the goal for what it is, living in this present moment. With Gemini North Node, it helps us to look at the details. Though it may feel foreign at first. If you got something going on in Gemini, it may feel a little bit easier. If it's rising or sun or moon. It's about our soul, our soul's desires. What is our soul desiring? It's about being clever and intelligent. It's about being inspired, aspiring to, aspiring to our truest potential. Realizing the existence of our soul. When we bring these two notes together, we can work in harmony. This is about revealing the soul. There's a gift here too. It's anchoring in this moment of discernment, breathing into your body deeply, breathing out. This time, inhale for the count of six, five, four, three, two, one. Suspend the breath for three, two, one. Exhale for six, five, four, three, two, one. Suspend the breath out for three, two, one. Inhaling, six, five, four, three, two, one. Suspend for three, two, one. Breath coming out, six, five, four, three, two, one. Suspend the breath out for three, two, one. Inhaling, three, oh, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Suspend the breath. Three, two, one. Breath out. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Suspend the breath out. Three, two, one. Last round. Inhaling. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Exhaling. Six, five, four, three. Two, one, suspend the breath out. Three, two, one. Allow yourself just to be in this moment, eyes slightly closed. Breath beautifully full. This is the time of us finding our freedom, our inner freedom, our inner freedom for speech. Especially as we move into a shift in consciousness when Pluto moves out of Capricorn. But first we have to go through this Pluto return, especially in the United States. So we shall look at, see what happens to our ability to communicate, especially online. Will certain rights be taken away from us? What is going to happen? What are we going to experience? So as Gemini is in this North Node, it's time for an activation. It's time to use our voice in the most appropriate way. So the question is, how are you using your voice? We come back to that first question. What would love do? What would love do? So how can we use our voice for love? For speaking words that find harmony and truth. No matter what is happening worldwide, are you coming back to you? So let's let go of all the fears, anxieties, all the things that aren't us, things that have been programmed, imprinted, told that this is the only way to exist. Let's let all of those go, take a deep breath in, and blow all of that out, just <sighs> empty yourself. We do that again, deep breath in. yourself. Just find stillness. Bring your hands, one on your belly, one on your heart. Take a deep breath in, belly first. Then your chest. And then sigh the breath out. And do one more deep breath, belly first. Then your chest. Sigh the breath out. One more time, belly. Chest. Just 
Extend the breath, bring your hands in front of your heart, Atma Anjali. Bow to your chest. Release the breath. Just finding yourself in this moment. Giving reverence for who you are. Taking with you this idea of just as we collect information, let's have discernment as we go along. This is learning about knowing what is right for us. What has been said may not always be true. Finding that which resonates within and maybe even resonates without. <laughs> so, from my heart to yours, may you be blissfully blessed. Have a beautiful day. Namaste.